guys, this is Boss Army. I'm just quick note before the video. I'm just on my Steam library. I thought I'd go on Ark. Um, so yeah, I've just finished my first recording session in a long time, and uh, my mic's still a bit crackly, so I apologise for that. And um, I just want to let you know this is episode one. Obviously, uh, we did start the server quite a while ago, so we were already on like metal tools, stone base, some pretty decent dinos, but nothing too OP. I just thought I'd mention for part one, I thought I'd leave it quite raw and quite unedited. So there's obviously some bits I've cut out, like breeding and stuff, uh, while I was mashing you. I don't think anyone wanted to hear that, so I cut that kind of thing out. But yeah, the rest of it's kind of uncut, so uh, that won't be the case for every video. Just maybe for the first few, and then I'll uh, get a grasp of how long it takes and how long people would like them and stuff, hopefully. So yeah, hope you enjoy episode one. Have fun. Hey guys. This is the Foss Army on ARK, on a PvP server actually, we're online, we're on the PvP Lost Island. The minute I am the only one on this, and I am admin, this is my friend's server. So I just thought I'd give you a quick intro, and a quick introduction to the entire, well our base really, I can't give you an introduction to the server because I don't know where everyone lives. But um, yeah, this is our base, we, there's um, four of us who share this base, but one's never really on. So yeah, we'll start off easy, taming pen, if you couldn't guess, it's S+, so when we tame someone we just take the wall out and put it back. Probably said was wild for a second there. That's a tribe saber. I've been breeding for a lot of mutations recently. It's a mantis saddle. Let me just drop that. Reinforced trap door. So yeah, there's a metal gate. We got both of them in a drop. That's the only one we have down, so the others aren't really too secure yet. Um, I'm going to start off over here because this actually isn't really mine. Mine doesn't look anywhere near this good. This is uh, the owner. Oh, yeah, I forgot he's got his plus. Let's turn it off. This is the owner's little dino pen. This is Luke's pen. I'll give you a quick intro to some of his dinos as well, and how his little pen works. It's a really nice pen. It looks great, but personally, I'm not sure what to use it. So he's got his IG up here. I think that was... I'll have a look. I think that was bred from mine. Yep, that was bred directly from mine. Um, so yeah, he's kind of picked his colours just to be cyan and something else. That saber was actually tribe use. I bred it up, but we put it in here because we thought it would be safer. So here's some of his little dinos. Then we've got a hell of a lot of dials and sabers, because we really want to get started with mutations. Uh, so we've got some blue-headed saber mutations, and actually I'm going to brag a little bit here, because I think so far I'm the only one who's found any mutations. i found them all. Um, but yeah, so he's got his sabers, his blue-headed saber, he's got our only, only white, uh, not white, only cyan saber. Uh, we're going to be doing some... That was weird. For some reason, Ark hates me recording. Uh, we've got dire wolves. Uh, yeah, he's got a mutated one here, he's got a red back. Uh, we have technically two mutations, but I'm going to count it as three because we've crossbred them. More sabers. There's another red back direwolf. I'm sure he's gotten one of the others. No, he hasn't. Oh, unless it's. Nope. And there's his horse. He's called Gypsy for some reason. And back to the saber. So, yeah, that's Lucas's little dino pen. That's all his dinos. We'll get to mine at the end. Um, the reason I'm doing mine last is because I need to take some. My, my, I need to take my two. Rex is over to my base. This is a little kibble pen, which so far hasn't worked at all. We've had no eggs out of it. We've had enough to make a lot of kibble from it, but other than that, like, we've had really a hell of a lot less than I expected. There was a fight a couple of days ago, and Akano killed a lot of stuff, but what's left kind of just got scattered about. The Iguanodon, I know it's not part of imprinting kibble, but we just have it here, and I know we're actually missing some things. We have a little bit of every kibble though, for imprinting. We're running dangerously low on Tyranodon though. I'm hoping to get another Rex up by the end of today. There's our Branto. I think that was a 112 tame. We've got a greenhouse, which, because it's arc, the plants always come up and tickle God's feet or whatever it tries to do, and it's ages in the sky. I think that's our original male saber. Yeah, he is. He's pathetic. He's like a 66. But yeah, someone decided to use him, and that's why all our sabers are pathetic. So yeah, um, I actually miscounted, we've got three long grass and one rock carrot rather than two of each. And we're using the S plus glass for that, because I didn't actually realise it gives greenhouse effect. It makes sense, but I didn't realise it. That's my little dino pen down there, and we all log off in the communal base. This is the communal base. Um, there's plenty of dinos around, some of them have been tagged, some of them haven't. If they haven't been tagged, they're kind of just tribe use or rejects or which ones we use for breeding. I've got that on Giga Strats because hopefully we'll be taming a Giga with it soon. Um, there's another blue head. Uh, that's my RG. If it's got a blue saddle on, it's mine. Admittedly, I've not gone all the way with that. And if it's got my tag on it, the FOS. 
I'm pointing at my monitor like you can see it. Um, then that's mine. So this one was actually imprinted. It's Rex. There's a Saber Silver. I thought I lost that. I don't have enough blue dye for that, so that's going to have to stay the way it is. So I think he's just about to hit his target health for 25k. Come on. Oh, he's close. Next level should do it. Uh, anything else in mind in here? Original female dire wolf. A big pile of things over here. I'm going to go K, not K, backspace and see if you can see anything interesting. More red back dire wolves. Where's the other one? Oh, here it is. This is just this is one we didn't name, but yeah, we've got one with blue feet as well. And I, at my base, have the only hybrid, which we'll get to in a minute. We've got plenty of algaes about. I'm still going to do some breeding with them because I want a mutated one if possible. A colour mutated. The only brother we've got, I think, is a nice colour. It's kind of this orange on the side and then green on top. It's got levels. We'll just put straight in weight. Hey, it's got plenty of berries. I'm going to have to try and not do that. Um... Also, I'm sorry about any offensive names. I know we've got a couple of offensive names lying about. Oh, wait, there's Frosty Foot, the original mutation. And there's a Fiamir that just pooped on everything. Um, yeah, show you a quick inside the base. That cage is purple for some reason. So we're not showing off that room, just in case anyone raises. We have um, the main kind of base. So it's a small base, but it works. So we've got crafting table, smithy, uh, campfires, refining forge, just a couple of storage boxes, Morton Pestle. We only have the one Morton Pestle, and the one refining forge. And in this room, we have beds in the middle of the floor, because they originally put there, but then with the fabricator moved there, we couldn't put the beds on top of the others. Uh, someone unconscious under the bed. Uh, got a fair few monkeys in here. I think one of them was bred up. I think it was that one. Um, a canvas with... That on. Oh, steam, arc, I don't know what, I don't know what they try to draw there, if I'm honest. Uh, preserving them we don't use. Close the door. Uh, this is our breeding area and fridge area. So we got, this is the, it might look a bit big for a breeding area, but that's because we breed like everything at a time and just kill what we don't need. Um, preserving bins for jerky. Air cons for hatching eggs. Fridge. I don't think there's any fertilized eggs in here at the minute. No, there isn't. And that's all our kibble and jerky and stuff. We did have a massive kind of crop. I don't know what the word would be. We, we ditched a lot of crops. We've got plenty of gasoline in there. This little room is nothing. It's literally just that. But I don't know. Lucas built the area and probably thought that could do with having a door. Uh, I think the only thing left to show you is my base. So I'll... Uh, Getting my please don't nerf. Whistle my Rexes and hopefully this will go down alright. Because last time they got stuck. Walk them off this cliff. Come on, murderer. You can do it. Alright, so I've got one. And I whistled the RG. Not the RG. It's definitely not an RG. The Bronto. Ah, uh, yeah, this is what happened last time. Right, come on. This one doesn't have a saddle as well. I'd rather it happen to the other one. We are going to be inbreeding our Rexes in a bit. I'll probably do that. I'm going to go on a quick meat trip with a couple of dire wolves so you can have a little look at some of my stuff and then we'll do some breeding, I think. This is going to be a very quick uh, episode. Because I've actually recorded a lot on this server and just not uploaded any of it. You have fun over there. Come on. Yes. Yes. Solid. Right, so this is my dino pen. Again, it's not it doesn't look as nice as Lucas's, but personally I prefer the way it works. Like I said, blue and black my colours, so there's my messed up oh, there's my messed up character who's got a purple hair and pink face, but I didn't do that. As you can probably guess. I don't know why I pressed T instead of Y. Right. So yeah, this is my little area. We've got the two diewolves I'm going to take out ready. Um, I'll show you the hybrid last. There's our two dodos. I only named this one. This one was mine and the other one just came in here because we thought they were mate boosted, but they're not. Uh, they're both female. Destroyer Worlds, my 172 dodo. And this is my sabers. I think I have the one blue head per that I personally own that I haven't actually tagged. And I've got Lily, Millie and Killy who were triplets. And yeah, there's my sabers. And then uh, hopefully you didn't see too much of that. Uh, a couple of redbacks. 
Scuffle of Default, a Bluefoot, and my Hybrid, who I couldn't think of a name, so I literally called Hybrid. He's a little bit injured because I just pumped like a lot of health onto him. Or her, him. Um, so yeah. So Blue Socks and Hybrid, and Hybrid's going to be doing that. Oh, don't you? No. Why? Everywhere you could go. Brilliant. Alright, I'm free. Alright, there you go. So, I'm going to go on a bit of a meat run. I'm going to get on Blue Socks. Blue Socks is a much higher level. I think he's got 8k health. He's got 8k health. There was his stats from before. He's almost fully imprinted. Hybrid's almost fully imprinted. The timer was a little bit messed up, so we couldn't get it a full imprint. Well, I probably could on Hybrid, but I just didn't. Right, what what's, what are you on? You on? You're on neutral. Hopefully you'll come in with me. He's on lowest, so we should get kind of pushed by this. You gonna attack? Oh well, this one needs to die, so we'll just go for it. I think I'm too close. If I whistle attack my target, it'll screw up my little pen. Everything will run in one corner. Looks like Blue Sucks has got this one on his own, or her own, I can't remember the gender. I think it's male. Alright, eat the Diplo. Alright, so I have... English. I do have two troughs... I'm all over the place. I do have two troughs I need to fill up. I'm not going to fill them completely, but just enough. Mate boosted life shows on a monkey. I'm savage enough. Yeah, we're far away enough now. Get it. Get it, hybrid. Get it. There you go. Brilliant. He's probably going to get stuck on a tree long before we get... Don't ask me why, but for some reason I thought I was a giga. <laughs> I panicked like hell then. Right, go ahead. Fighters. This should be a hell of a lot quicker than a hybrid's attacking too. Uh, how much meat is that? Two diplos is gonna be quite a bit. It's not enough. It's not. It's definitely not enough. It might be enough for one trough maybe. Oh, I like that colour. That's stego. We're in the market for a m male. A bit low level. Our max level is 120 rather than 180, because I know some servers have that turned up, but 88's still a little low for me. I like aiming high. That's a Truodon. I'm going to kill that before it becomes a problem. I know it doesn't tend to become a problem until night time, but I hate Truodons with passion. I said I, would take, I wouldn't take Hybrid out as well, because it's the only Hybrid we have. Wow, these Truodons. Hybrid better not die. Hybrid better not die. Come on. Hybrid's looking really bloody. Right, we've got nerdy glasses skin about nine times now. It's crazy. So how much did that take us down by? Took us down to like 3k, that's, that's most of hybrid's health. Wow. I'm gonna head back for now just because hybrid's the only hybrid we have. As much as it's not gonna be too hard to breed again, I don't wanna risk it. I wouldn't have imprinted him if I thought about it. So yeah, I'll probably just take out an RG, get a Bronto or something for the other trough. Uh, yeah. oh, we do have S plus on, hence all this. I'm pretty sure I've mentioned it briefly, but yeah. Sabres can keep what they got on them. Uh, I'm too lazy to put you guys back just yet. I was whistling something that wasn't even following me. Um, please no nerfs to lower level. He could do some leveling. 
I'm gonna gamma down real quick. That's balloon quality I need. Oh, boop. Uh, did I misspell that? Oh, I don't care, let's just go. I think I did. I'm pretty sure I saw it went wrong, but it's not that bright. Hey, Theo. Perfect start. So I think it's this bird actually has... Yeah, it has a melee mutation. So that's why it's melee is freakishly high. I mean, I have leveled it a little bit. I forgot to like, follow this one, actually. But yeah, as much as I have leveled it a little bit. It was a twin, but someone got the other twin killed. Um, but yeah, as long as we have this one, mutation shouldn't go. I am going to breed a couple of Argies, but like I said, I'm only, I might... No, no, I can't really keep one. Yeah, I'll we'll only keep them if they're colour mutated. Because that's really what we want. We want fancy colours. And I know you can paint them, but it's not the same, is it? Breeding for it just feels so much more satisfying. Especially for the one male that does all the breeding. So yeah, I mean, I hate this little lag. It already lags when I'm recording, and my graphics look terrible. Like, I'm on weird graphic settings. I'm on custom, but I think it's like epic, medium, epic, high, medium, medium, high. That's not, That shouldn't be this bad, but the trees look like they're straight out of GameCube. Alright, now the balloon quality is too much. There you go. I can hear a pig. Oh, no, it's Parasaur. I was going to say they changed the sounds. Lots of Parasaurs. Parasaurs are meaty enough. Come here. Don't fly off. Just fly off like it's, you know, an actual bird. Well done. A trike? I'll kill it no matter what it is. It's a trike anyway. I thought it looked a bit big to be a uh, Paki Rhino. So have a quick scout of the mountain, see if there's anything worth killing, or maybe even taming, if it wants to have some stam. <laughs> and then uh, we'll head off. I'm going to keep a lot of hide on us. We've actually nearly filled up a smithy. I mean, I'm known as a bit of a hoarder. But, uh, <laughs> I really need to get rid of some of that, it's a bit ridiculous. I've got advanced sniper bullets and don't have a fabricated sniper. Pharaoh, Rex, Pharaoh scare me, just because they now do torpor, which is stupid. Like they needed buffing. Male 24, easy enough. That's a nice colored RG. Oh, I got the Rex. I thought I got the RG there. Now I got the RG. Did the Pharaoh die? Huh? I nearly get 500 melee with this thing. Uh, I'll pick up and kill this saber and then we'll head back. This is a higher level, then I'll pick up and stick it in. The no, it's not. It never is. Actually, a decent level male saber would be pretty sick. Except ours was terrible. So we've got decent looking sabers with awful stats because they all got the dad stats so it's like a 66 before tame. The mother was a 120. So if we could get like a 120 saber, that'd be pretty sick. I think that needs to be the mission. Then we can start again with the sabers or maybe, um, if, yeah, if we could breed the... We could get rid of every saber that's not color mutated. Keep the new ones. For the stats. And start again with that, and any color mutations we get to bonus. So sabers actually have three color regions that can mutate, and we've got two different regions, which is good. So we are going to try and hybrid them, like I said. We did also say that basically whoever finds the mutation gets personal ownership. But I do all the breeding, just because I'm a bit greedy. I'll come on before everyone else and make sure I do it. But um, yeah, so I'm, I'm not too greedy in the sense where I keep the mutations. I've got a couple of personal ones, but like that blue one's at Luke's base because it's going to be safer there. Did I ever pick up that saddle? Yes, sword. No, it's too messy to be sword, I should have known. 
I'll put it in alphabetical in a minute. We need a bookshelf so I can get rid of all these blueprints. I took them out the smithy because we ran out of space in an S plus smithy. Alright, from here to the greenhouse. I forgot to jump. Quick drink. Alright, it was in my saddle directs, I think. There it is. So if I take my blue head. Wait, what about my girls? Can, 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 can. Wait, one of them must have been male. Okay, so yeah, two of the triplets and their mum can breed. But I'm gonna have to move you. I'm trying to get these guys to 5k health, but it takes up half their levels just doing that because there's so bad sabers. My, my plan was to get a pack of sabers and a pack of diewolves and take them out together just because I thought it looked sick, but I can't because these sabers won't last five minutes. They're pathetic. Right, I'll put all those levels in health, and I'm aiming for 5k, remember. It won't get there. Not even close. I think this one's male, isn't it? Yeah. I'm pretty sure uh, cyan blue one's female. And the plants are tickling God's toes again. Ooh, white diamond. So yeah, hopefully we can get this hybrid mutation. I mean, it was one person that I tried with things. The cyan one looks better on its own, but I want a blue head, blue body one, and I'm going to call it frostbite. his horse, there's his saber. Well, not his saber. I forgot to offload the meat. <laughs> I just remembered. That could have got messy. So every mutation, every colour mutation that's come from the sabers has actually come through my male, so he's going to be the one who's breeding with all the females. Other than this one. So like I said, this one we want a hybrid. And I lied through the wall. So I'm not in a group. There we go. I was wondering why I was sitting so long. Um, yeah, I'll probably cut back to you guys when this thing's pregnant. I'll be back. Alright, she's pregnant. Uh, so I'm going to grab my bed, because it's got all the meat in it anyway. I'm going to pull the meat over to the trough. I mean, all these carnivores are going to be hungry, so it's going to be fun. Uh, it was... Please no nerf, isn't it? Where is please no nerf? Did I forget a Lucas's? I left my gate open. And it's foggy as hell. So people on the server has been asked, yeah, have been asking us for a fog remover. But personally, I like it. I love raiding in the fog. But then again, we never really win, <laughs> if I'm honest. Where's my bird? I'm sure it wasn't this one I took. Where's Jess's bird? There's some free food. I was worried that Sable was going to read it then. Oh, it's on the roof. I always do that. Every time. It should be close enough to pull it, any anyway. Ugh, pull it in anyway. Raw meat. Feeding trough? We can reach the other feeding trough. I'll get my bird and my other bird. Pull them in. That's not bad. So apparently, this trough has food in it. This one's not S+. Plus. This one we got in the drop. No. No way can it reach my feeding trough from there. It's the pull range. No, it can't. 
That's what feeding trough was that trying to pull from. Yeah, it definitely can't. I'll grab, please, no nerf. Hopefully pick up the mail. There you go. I should have taken a saddle off the female first, because now I'm going to have to do another trip. She's used to breeding direwolves. I'm going to need to unshow that. No, I don't want third. Oh well, I'll take it for now, I guess. Right. Ride. Back on. Ooh, big blue drop. I don't know I got excited about that. At the end of the day, it's still a blue drop. It's not going to be good. Oh, I forgot to mention as well. You probably noticed at some point, but um, these are my stats and level. Just leave them up there for a second. And that's good enough. My character's pretty messed up. I don't know why I made it like that. I thought that was a Dimorph we got in then. Let's get it on a bit of an angle and dismount left. That's all I have to do it. So I'm gonna need you, 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 and you. Oh wow, the only one I don't need is the one that's over there. Actually, I'm gonna go grab that blue drop. I know I was just mocking it for being a, like a big blue drop, but I don't care. Another dire bear saddle on a tree platform. I know uh, Luke's is wanting to build a tree uh, tree base, so we'll probably take that. There's the mail. We're getting dropped in. So we're going to breed with every Sabre that's not Lucas's, because I think he's got certain plans to try and mutate his in a certain way. With these guys, I'm just going for a fresh mutation. If I can get a third colour mutation, I'd be quite happy. But We've been really lucky with mutations to do this. We've got four mutations all on mammals. I'm going to breed up the Argies and the Rexes too, but I'm, I'm not going to be hatching them up today. Not the Rexes anyway, they take forever on this server. Imprint goes up by 3% per time. I'm going to get a hell of a lot of kibble to do it. Might speak to Luke about being able to change that actually. And we ran out of stam. I should get those two like really close together. I'm quite happy with that. All three of them really. Uh, I did take the saddle. I'm gonna go put these back in storage though. The, actually, what percentage is she on pregnancy wise? 37. Yeah, we got loads of stam. I'm not gonna breed out uh, the other sabers up until that one's. Giving birth. <laughs> I'm just gonna. Oh, I dropped it. Where did that go? Oh, okay. Am I a uh, saber down? I forgot to put those two back. I got one on follow or something. I swear I'm missing one. Should be the two twins. Oh no, that's it. The two twins, the mother and the male. 
Okay. Um. Forty odd percent. We can handle that. Uh, we'll get these guys into a big pile, and then we'll sort them out once they're pregnant. Ah, uh, that didn't come through on Steam for some reason. Oh, yep, it did. Um. So yeah, this guy's also on our server. But yeah, I kind of went up and painted his base the other day, so he's probably not going to be too happy. <laughs> oh, I don't have any flowers or mushrooms on me. Alright, looks like I'm eating berries from the Bronto. Oh, my fingers are cold. I'm all over the place. Right. As soon as these savers give, <laughs> as soon as these savers give birth, we'll uh, no 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 no, I forgot to put them all on highest. You're on low, lowest, sorry. Okay, right. So now these are following me. Enable wandering. Enable wandering. Enable wandering. One of you must be on lowest. If you're coming that close to me. Oh, I'm on taming group. I was the group. Sorry. With a male. 57%. See, I, I think this might be kind of a short episode after editing, but I think once all these sabers give birth, I'll probably end it there. I'll probably also breed up my RGs, but I'll do that off camera and then we'll hatch eggs probably next time. Um, see what percentage she on again? 61. Okay, I suppose, um, I suppose we'll cut back when they're about to give birth. I'll see you guys then. Oh! Damn, I was on my phone and wasn't paying attention at all. It's a blue head. <laughs> um, so yeah, it's a blue head female. It's got three mutations and something. Only one of them's colour. How many mutations does the mum have? Reflects her character. <laughs> the mum had one. I think it's just got two random stat mutations. I'd need to get their dad over to check, I don't know. Either way, we said we were only keeping it if it was a... Wait, I... No, I, I thought it was, please, no. Oh, no, 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 I thought, yeah. Oh. Huh. What are these mutations in? Two, one, four, melee. I have no idea what this mutation could be in. Um, either way, I'm sorry to be brutal. Oh, it survived. <laughs> I ran out of arrows now, I'm not using trunks on you. Um, these guys are 41%. Should really drop that one off. And there's a yellow drop relatively close. I know where that is. That's on the little islandy, not the islandy, little headlandy bit. Oh, please tell me we still got the saddle in there. Oh, oh, thank God.
God for that. <laughs> Yeah, I think the plan for the rest of the episode, pretty simple, and again, I'm sorry if it's been a bit short, but we'll uh, breed up the Argies and the Rexes, but we're not going to hatch them yet. You're on follow, aren't you? Brilliant. And we don't have a saddle. Just to run it back. Come here. I'm going to gamma up real quick. Trip on a safe settle on an RG. It's okay, guys. I only have like what 1,195 hours in the game. I'll get there in the end. I didn't need this for here, did I? Probably should fly out of his base, but I st oh. just started running. This doesn't feel that quick to me, despite the fact I've got my movement speed a little bit. See, I think off cam I'll breed every dire wolf, and there's a hell of a lot of them. Um, I'll also breed up those eggs, but again, I'm not going to hatch them just yet. And I don't know. I don't know. We'll see if we can find out anything else. As much as all we really do on this server is breed at the minute, it just gets a bit boring. Might even go. Oh, I know what I could do. We've, since there's only a 30 player limit on this server, um, we limited everyone to uh, three bases. So you can build elsewhere, you can keep stuff in there, but, you know. Uh, oh, and also we've said if you're raiding, you can only raid one base at a time. So if you're raiding someone and they've moved everything into the other base, you can't go and raid that base for a couple of days. I know it's a little bit OP. If you're good enough, you can get all your stuff out, but at the end of the day, if we're getting raided at this base and we've got another base, we're going to personally, I know no one else is going to do this, but we're going to personally have a bit of respect. And if we're getting properly beaten, we're going to leave some decent stuff behind for them to take. I mean, we're not going to get wiped. Probably, like, say we've got, and this is an exaggeration, we don't have this much. Because we've accidentally blocked the beaver spots. <laughs> but, um, say we had, I don't know, 6,000 CP, we'd probably leave two or 3,000 and take the rest. Because, I mean, if... if it costs more to raid people than you're going to get back, and people are going to stop raiding, and that's what makes Ark fun. But anyway, I guess I'll see you guys when these things are about to give birth. Hey, so what twins from that one? Come on, move, move, move. I need to get you kids. Doesn't look like there's any blatant colour mutation. That one's giving birth. Come on, I need you to move. Have you not given birth yet? 99.9. .9. I need you to move. I don't think we're going to get anything from these, you know. Kind of happy the other one's stuck. Don't know how to check them, they're twins. And yeah, this one's stuck. The sabers starve, they starve. I'm not, I mean, they're just gonna die anyway. I even made more arrows specifically to kill them. Why is that doing local now? That should be... Oh well. Um... That will do. That's probably what I wanted to see. And it doesn't look like there's anything blatant. Nope, no mutations. So, yeah. That was kind of a failed episode, <laughs> in a way. You saw a blue head get born, but we got... Oh, missed. You got plenty of them. This is probably the most fun bit now. Just murdering the babies. Then they all panic. And rightfully so.
this could be fun. Baby saber hunting season. I'd be a monster if I did this in real life. This is probably the most evil thing I've ever done. Just wiping out generations of baby diables. Not diables, sabers. Just because they're not freakishly deformed after inbreeding them. Oh, and in case you're wondering, um, the male I bred them with is her son, her grandson, and her nephew. <laughs> it's messed up. It's so messed up that it's beautiful. Uh, anyway, in the purple, oh, in the purple light of this drop, I'm gonna take my stuff and leave. But actually, I'm gonna leave one of them there because I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna move them all off. Oh, yeah. English. I'm gonna move them all back off cam. And get on the damn bird. I'm gonna end it looking at my beautiful Rex because I'm very. I thought, was, um, I thought that was a crude on them. And here, this is a stats. I'm gonna breed her up soon as well. Oh, she's got obsidian on her. Um, yeah, she's almost on 25k health, which is a target. That's what she started with. Uh, this is I, I did that folder after imprint. I think. No, I couldn't have done it. it. Must have been before imprint. So remember, she was on 8k health. But yeah, it was bred from a 112 and a 120. Just not bad. And then that's the 120 behind her, I think. Yeah. I'll take a 20k. Him, 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 him. That's, I don't know if it's the... Yeah, that's... I don't know. It might be the 112. Either way, it was a pretty high level Rex. But that's where I'm going to end it. Hopefully you've enjoyed our little base tour. Uh, actually, I might do end it with a drop. <laughs> I'm still going to sign out anyway. I hope you've enjoyed a little base tour. Um, next time, hopefully, I'll be breeding up some dire wolves and some actual dinosaurs instead of mammals. Uh, oh, yeah, this is a little dumb beetle famine cooking pot as well, by the way. I didn't show these off. We only have the five beetles, and I haven't fed them in a while, but they've got the feeding trough of rotten meat, so they're not going to die. Alright, purple drop. Let's see what I get. Yeah, I'll use it. I'll destroy it. But, yeah, this has been the Foss Army. Can you subscribe? If you like to like it. Sorry we only had the one mutation and it's one we already had. Hopefully next time we'll get something a little bit better. Because so next time's gonna be another breeding episode and then I'll go out and actually do something. Um or I could actually do it next episode. I could just only do something if it's only show you um mutations type thing. I'm building this little metal box around me so I can destroy it in case you're wondering. Destroy it for resources. A demo gun out. And um but you know what? No, screw it, I'm living here now. Screw the others, I'm starting my own tribe. I think this is my tribe, actually. Yeah, this is my tribe. <laughs> um, but yeah, if you subscribe, if you like, like it, I'm pretty sure I've already said that. I'll see you next time.